In this video we'll briefly discuss what is tranexamic acid, and how it works, what it's used for, the dose and side effects, and contraindications and precautions. Tranexamic acid is an antifibrinolytic agent. It competitively and reversibly inhibits the activation of plasminogen, via binding its several distinct sites, knowing that activation of plasminogen to plasmin degrades and dissolves fibrin clots, so by occupying the necessary binding sites, tranexamic acid prevents the dissolution of fibrin, thereby stabilizing the clot and preventing hemorrhage. In other words, it works by blocking the breakdown of blood clots, which prevents bleeding. Tranexamic acid is available as 500 mg tablets, and also available as injection. It is used for short-term treatment in patients with hemophilia, to reduce or prevent hemorrhage, and to reduce bleeding during and following a tooth extraction. And the usual dose of tranexamic acid for adults in this case is 10 mg per kilogram intravenously, 3 to 4 times daily, for 2 to 8 days. And it is also used for the treatment of heavy menstrual bleeding, and the usual dose in this case is 1 gram 3 times a day, for up to 5 days, to be initiated when menstruation has started, and the maximum dose is 4 grams per day. Tranexamic acid may also be used in hereditary angioedema, epistaxis, and in thrombolytic overdose. Tranexamic acid may cause diarrhea, nausea and vomiting, dizziness, and feeling lightheaded. Stop using tranexamic acid and call your doctor immediately if you have problems with your vision, including color vision, a lightheaded feeling, like you might pass out, a seizure, painful or difficult urination or blood in your urine. Signs of a stroke, such as sudden numbness or weakness, especially on one side of the body, severe headache, slurred speech, and balance problems. Signs of a blood clot in the lung, such as chest pain, sudden cough, wheezing, rapid breathing, and coughing up blood. Or signs of a blood clot in your leg, such as swelling, warmth, or redness in an arm or leg. That's all for this video, subscribe and click on the bell icon for more animated medical videos like this one.